So covering up my face like this allows um, you to see the uh, the background of the flags better. Um, <coughs> I wanted to show you a few icons um, or images of icons. This is partially uh, the icon of protection. Um, here's my favorite Coptic icon. I um, used to own this one. It's the icon of nativity. Um, it's one of the ones that survived the Islamic conquest. It's one of the most ancient icons. And as you can tell, um, the, uh, let me take these off for a moment. Uh, it's cropped so you can't see it, but the, um, the, uh, the Magi ride on horses, not camels. That was the mistake the West made. Now, the icon that uh, anyone who attended services yesterday, <coughs> Sunday, would see was this one. Um, the expulsion of Eden. Um, and I realized this one, too, is kind of cropped because... Um, this is actually a seraphim right here. It should be a cherubim. There's a debate whether cherubim and seraphim are two different creatures or not, but uh, I think they are. And then there's a very famous one. I just like this one, the three use in the fire with uh, Nebuchadnezzar. Was it Nebuchadnezzar that put them in the fire? Uh... And then, uh, of course, um, indisputable proof of uh, Theotokos appearing in Cairo, and even the atheists and the um, Muslims even recognized it just as the witnesses in Portugal. Uh, and then, of course, we have the wacky mushroom type stuff from Germany. We all know what the monks were consuming then. Uh, okay. Um, Pro-life. Um, <coughs> I have problems with legislation um, and enforcing things, um, but, uh, I agree with, uh, Ben Shapiro on this point. I believe that doctors who perform abortions, um, are at minimum guilty of, um, second degree murder. And I believe that Gosnell is guilty of first degree murder. And although I am against the death penalty, um, because mistakes can be made, um, these are procedures that are that are written down and documented. Uh, there is a lot of documentation, and there is no dispute to what that happens. Uh, uh, in uh, in a abortion, especially late term abortion, and I would reserve the death penalty only for abortion doctors if I were the emperor of the world, which I am not. Um, that is my stance. That is what I believe. Um, there can be Christians who say, "Look, I believe abortion is abhorrent," or. It, it's kind of strange when talking about it in Spanish, you have to say uh, provoked abortion because a miscarriage is a, is natural abortion, right? <laughs> but um, I'm talking about the intentional um, destruction of the 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 pre born baby in the womb. Um, 
We know it as heartbeat, brain function, things like that. Uh, <coughs> so, <clears throat> um, but can there be a Christian who is not only pro-choice, but um, does not believe that abortion is a sin or could encourage somebody to get a late-term abortion? Um, I guess anything's possible, um, but looking at the book of James and us rec recognizing things like, well, if you're encouraging people to rape, murder, and commit genocide, then no, your actions speak for your faith. But it, you know, faith is loyalty. It's, it's, it's active. It's putting one foot in front of the other. It's not, uh, it's not just a belief, right? And, you know, and even beliefs have consequences to them because we live them out, right? Um, <clears throat> if you truly believe something, it does affect your life greatly. I would say no. I would say, you know, no, that that couldn't happen. So the idea of... Um, you know, there was a, I, I was in an AA group many, many moons ago. I was fooled into going to one. And this, uh, there was, this, the people were, the, I mean, it was about 60 people there. And this guy said, yeah, there was this doctor who performed abortions and he went to collect his mail one day and he had his legs blown off and he started saying, um, need that prayer, God help me with things that I can control. Uh, cope with the things that I can't and the wisdom to know the difference I, I butchered it, whatever it is and he said and the pain stopped immediately because he was basically using it as a mantra now um, I can't think of a more monstrous thing um, I would rather see that man drunk on Skid Row um, than performing murders um, this may be controversial to the atheists and, uh, people who call themselves secular humanists, but, and the, uh, the, uh, what gets called liberal Christians, which are Episcopalians and Unitarians, basically, um, but not for any believing Roman Catholic, Eastern Orthodox, um, Missouri Senate Lutheran, anyone who believes in the Nicene Creed and the Trinity. Um, I mean, it's it, not even controversial to Muslims or practice actual Jews, not ethnic Jews, but actual Jews who believe in God. Um, and Zoroastrians and Mandan, I can't think of a, of a, of anyone of any spiritual background that would believe that a, a late-term abortion is anything than horrific. All right, uh, peace to you. May God save Serbia, Syria, and Ireland. Um, and let's see, I think, yep, it's adjusted. So I got my, uh, one of my favorite shirts on today. I know everybody has problems with the Guadalupe one, but this one I believe is fully orthodox. And I found a cool medal. It's not a holy medal, but it's like an old uh, silver dollar uh, type thing for my head, just so I know front and back. Alright, peace to you.